Hello there traders, you are watching weekly stock market review on InstaForex TV channel with me, Dahmin Salomova. On Friday, August 26, leading US stock indices showed mixed trade and amid comments of Fed chairperson Janet Yellen, who enhanced investors' expectations for a possible interest rate hike by the Fed this year. The Nasdaq composite slightly edged up to 5,218.92, but failed to grow by the weak results. The index lost 0.4% since last Friday. The Dow Jones Industrial Average dropped to 18,395.40 by the session end. The Dow declined by 0.9% over the week. The Standard & Poor's 500 decreased to 2,169.04 on Friday. Throughout the week, the S&P 500 fell by 0.7%. Janet Yellen provided new signals of the Federal Reserve's readiness to raise its fund rate this year. Year. Besides, Fed Vice Chairman Stanley Fisher confirmed the possibility of a September hike and added that the Federal Reserve might lift its key rate twice by the year end. Friday's GDP report from the US failed to shake market sentiment. According to the second estimate, the US economy expanded by 1.1% on an early basis in the second quarter. The first assessment supposed 1.2% growth. The the revised reading coincided with market forecasts. In addition, the used consumer confidence index fell from 90 to 89.8 points in August. Its preliminary reading was 90.4 points and analysts had expected it to advance to 90.8 points. Shares in Herbalife shed by 2.3% following news that billionaire investor Carl Icahn has recently discussed selling his stake in the nutritional products company to a group including Herbalife's arch nemesis Bill Ackman. During the session, the quotes had been down by as much as 4.7%. The final price has $60.50 per share. And Jose Bush and Beth shares rose by 1.2% by the end of the New York session on Friday. The final quote was $125.74 per share. The company warned Friday its beer Mega Mega with Seb Miller PLC could lead to thousands of job losses in the coming years. You have watched weekly stock market review on Insta Forex TV channel. See you later.